What's going on, guys? Is waiting this, for something? Are you waiting for something? Good morning, neighborhood community. I don't know what they're waiting for. Uh-oh. Getting all excited over here. Anyway, we're up nice and early this morning. Um, I'm with Kirsty, or Kirsty's here. And go ahead and tell them what's going on, Kirsty. We're going to my ranch so we can uh, meet up with a hauler to take my horse to a vet close by so he can have a minor surgical procedure done. Yep, and I'm going to hold Paloma's hoof. I'm going to hold Kirsty's hand <laughs> and um, bringing some coloring stuff because we don't know exactly how long the procedure is going to take and how long we're actually going to be there. So bringing some coloring stuff with us so we can color. And yep. I got my fidgy in there. Do you have your fidgy? I have my fidgets. Then. Okay, we have our fidgies. Yep. How are you feeling? So I'm actually... <coughs> feeling a little bit better today but we'll be mostly sitting so I don't think it'll be a yeah. too big of a deal and I ate this morning and I didn't <laughs> feel sick I had some bacon this morning I cooked Good. it a little bit more than I normally do um, so I'm wondering if that's part of my issue um, so I cooked it a little bit more than I normally do and uh, I didn't feel nauseous after I ate so coolness Good. Yeah. So, still a little achy and have a headache, but for the most part, I think I'm doing okay. Cool. How are you feeling? Because you said you were starting to feel a I'm, little blah last night. I'm fine. <clears throat> I'm going to probably be continue doing what I've been doing in the garage, if, if I have the time. Again, <laughs> mow the lawn. Dave <laughs> might come over, but uh, one of the jobs that uh, <coughs> we got our lead on... He's, he might do if he got a hold of them. So we'll see how that works out. So we are off because it's off yep. our rockers. Because um, it's time. To <laughs> I think we're always off our rockers. Too. And I think the audience knows that too. <laughs> <laughs> it's not an audience. It's a community. Okay. The neighborhood community is already aware that we are completely off our rockers all mm -hmm. the time. At least her and I are. Yes. Uh, I was hoping you wouldn't include me in that. <laughs> and she is too. Mm -hmm. All the and him, mm -hmm. he's totally off his rocker. Totally. Rock. Mm -hmm. He's the pride Mwah. of the house. <laughs> huh, boom, boom. All right, guys, we'll catch up with you. Late. I'm gonna have the camera so I can film some of Paloma and what's going on and stuff. So we'll catch up with you later. Bye. Good morning, Paloma. He says good morning. I didn't get breakfast and I'm upset. He's grumpy. He didn't get to eat. Just like a human being, a horse <laughs> or any animal having surgery cannot have any food the night before. So, yeah. Nope. But he doesn't seem to be too, too grumpy. I think he is. He's just like hiding in a way. He's like, no. Everybody else got fed but me. So he's giving all the other horses dirty looks. He's watching him eat and he's like, I'm horrified. He's <laughs> like, I want your food. <laughs> it's okay, Paloma. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. You get to have nice special treats when you get back. If, he, if the vet says it's okay. If, it, if the vet says it's okay, <laughs> I'll buy you a carrot. A nice big carrot. Maybe a couple of them. I have carrots. Okay, well, I'll, I'll give you some carrots that your mother has. I always have to have carrots. Are you kidding me? What other veg? Apples. They like apples. They like apples, yes. They love apples. Maybe I'll bring you an apple. A nice, red, juicy apple. How would you like that? Huh? How would you like that? He would love that, actually. I'll bring you a nice, juicy, red apple. He's like, ooh, look at my lips. That sounds good. Okay, so here right. goes Paloma into the trailer. Nice trailer. Let somebody borrow it. Do you want me to take him in or are you going to take him in? Oh, I can take him in. He looks great. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Maybe she can get the full, you know, just don't. 
try not to get her face on there. It's okay, honey. All right, so Val and Kirsty are off, and we are left to our research, and uh, we're doing a pretty good job, I would have to say. Look at this. Dead Guy Ale. If you have not tried it, okay, it is guys, very, so very, very good. Paloma. She, he just came home from the vet, and he's doing wonderful. Look, he's even eating. So we groomed him a little bit, but we stayed away from his tail area because that's where they took the samples. The melanomas. The melanomas from. So he is, we stayed away from his tail. We're going to let him rest for a couple of days before we do anything with him. I do have a red delicious apple that I want to give him after he's done eating his hay. So... He's a good boy. He did really good at the vets. Did really good, didn't he? Yes, he did. He did fabulous. Yeah. I'm glad it was him instead of Gavilon because Gavilon would have panicked. Yeah. Yeah. And while he was at the vets, we went and ate, and we didn't think he was going to be done that quick. We ate, and we came back, and she's like, oh, he's done. Yep. And here is so. Mr. Gavilon. Gavilon? Gavilon? Gavilon, yeah. Gavilon. And I call him Gabby. Here's Gabby, and he already had his red delicious apple, but I happened to be proud of myself. I took him out of his pen, and I groomed him. See, look how shiny his coat is. And he looks beautiful. I groomed him all by myself, and I brought him back. I took his fly mask off. I put his halter on. Halter on. Yeah. And I brought him out, and I hooked him up to the, what are those called? Cross ties. Cross ties. Yep. And I groomed him and everything, and I gave him lots of hugs and kisses. And he just got his shots. Yes, he got his things. shots. But he, he was a good boy, too. Weren't you, Gab? Oh, did I scare you? He doesn't like his ears touched. I know that, but I couldn't reach his face. <laughs> Go for his neck or shoulder. <laughs> I know. Ah. Got his shoulder, guys. See? <laughs> He's way down there. So, we're just waiting now. We're keeping an eye on Paloma for a little bit, and then I'm going to give her her app, or him, his apple. Um, if he doesn't take it right now, we're going to come back a little later and just walk the track. Maybe he'll take it then. Are you serious? He loves apples too. Paloma. Should I take a little bite out of it? Mm, we can just try later. Sure. Yes, although it would be better for you too. Well, yeah, try it. Try it. Just stick it under his mouth. Stick it under his mouth and see if he'll take it. Yes. Are you serious? He's turning it down. He has never turned down an apple. Well, he hasn't had his hay yet today. Yeah, that's true. So that could very well be why. Kitty in the tall grass. Okay. Just showing my range. My yeah, voice, I, see. I see. It's totally out of tune, but you know, I have a different range. I see. <laughs> so, I had a wonderful day yesterday. Yes, you did. Kevin had a wonderful night last night. I suppose. <laughs> if I could have filmed it, it wouldn't have been a fan friend family friendly video though. I was gonna draw on his behind um, with oh. a sharpie. But okay. Yeah. <laughs> but it wouldn't have been family friendly, so I couldn't do it. But 
yeah, I had a good day yesterday. I went shopping and did Megan's Christmas shopping. She's all done now. Um, pretty much everybody's done except for Brian. I still have to figure out what I'm going to get for Brian. So I sent out a message to Megan to see what I should get him. Um, it's going to be a small Christmas this year, but Christmas isn't for gifts. Christmas is for spending time together and sharing love and joy. You bet. We you looking at your, your, is there a baby in there? Must be. Yeah. So, um, uh, Dave was over yesterday and we were supposed to uh, work on our office space upstairs or stuff in the garage, but we ended up doing some research. Doing some research. So, as usual, we end up getting carried away, and uh, just a tad bit carried away. <coughs> got nothing else done. So, so today we'll probably be putting up yesterday's video from Val and at the ranch, and with Kirsty, and uh, we didn't film a whole bunch, but we do have some. So we'll combine today and tomorrow's, so. or yesterday's and today. And. So I'll continue working on whatever it is I'm working on. So. And I'm supposed to go to Kayla's today, but I haven't heard from her yet, and I tried calling her already. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to just watch some Big Bang, because I miss my Big Bang, my Big Bang, Bang, Bang Theory. Bang. Blah, 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 blah. So I have seasons one through six. But it's gone on way longer than that, and I've missed all of them. And you can't get them on Netflix without paying for them. So that totally sucks. So I'm just going to watch some of the older ones and do some coloring. And that's about it for me today, unless Kayla calls. <coughs> and decides she wants to get together. Um... Or if Kirsty decides she wants to come hang out, and if she comes and hangs out and then Kayla calls, we'll just both go over to Kayla's house. So, whatever. We'll see what we're going to do. But, uh, Kirsty bought me a cup last night. Uh-huh. Oh, and got another new Fiji. Very nice, dear. And you can press it and it does different. Different patterns. Groovy. I'm addicted to fidget spinners, okay? Yeah. I now own four. Nice. I would have owned five if we could ever find the green one, but we can't find the green one. I think it accidentally got thrown away. But. That's okay. I still own four. So this is I an... I feel so studious. This is an industrial uh, work table. I that, love it. That I got for free? Yes. Very cool. We used to just have a big table here on two sawhorses. It was, yeah, it was a door. A it's door. A, Sorry. Yeah. I and still have the two sawhorses. Yeah. I'm not sure what to do with them, though. Hang them up somewhere? <laughs> Probably a good idea. Like everything else is hung up in this garage? Um... But this has electrical outlets, so when I'm wood burning and stuff like that. So I'm still every, I'm still having trouble clearing my table back here. Still got a lot of stuff that needs to be put away. That is not a table to be worked on. No, it always I, ends I know up collecting that. stuff. Um, my what what is that? My little hand drill thingy. Uh huh. That can go over here. Yeah. Permanently. Um, my guns can go over here, wherever you find them. Your guns? My, um... Your wood burning stuff? Yes, thank you, my wood burning thing. I was like, I don't know what she's talking about. I couldn't think of what I was trying to say. My wood burning things can go over here. <laughs> um, permanently. And, you know, if we can get another one of those things eventually and put it under here, mm -hmm. like my little round runes, that mm -hmm. I do could go underneath here in yeah. a drawer 
and stuff like that. So do you see how she has moved into my that. garage already? Excuse me, whose wor woodworking shop is this? Mine. And Who Harry's. makes the wands in here and the runes in here that we take to rent fairs? <laughs> and I'm going to need to be able to get to my toolbox over there. Well, you can get to it. Yeah, look at all the crap in front of it. That's all your tools. <laughs> I have no idea where our hand carving set went. It's under the table over there. Okay, that we need to get a sharpener thing and sharpen all of those. Yes, dear. Mm -hmm. We do have a sharpener thing. Well, then you need to get on sharpening them. What is taking so long? I, I could show you how to sharpen them. Be glad to. All right. She's all out here sharpening everything. <laughs> everything in here needs to be sharpened. All my tools for my lathe needs to be sharpened, too. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. Okay, then. All right. But I love my new workbench. It's very nice. And it's going to be very cool when and it's fully it really functional. Yeah, I like free. It's going to be free. The truck. Um, your remotes are not going on my workbench. Yes, they are. No. Because no. my TV is in here. Well, this is my workbench. I sit here and work. Well, you can watch TV, too. Well, then they're going to need to be in a drawer or something. Yeah. They have little drawers that you can hook on here that hang, and they could go in that little. But the drawer. little thing can't bother my arm though. Like when I'm. It like, can I'm hook on to the side over yeah. here, and it has to be like out of the way so that way we're just in comfort. We have to be comfortable when we're working. Yeah. And it works that way for gaming too. It has to be like smooth surface. So well, while I'm working, gaming? and she's gaming. Yeah. Well, no, I'm, I'm, when we're here, I'm, I'm, we're going to be working, but I'm just saying it works the same way as when I'm gaming. It's got to be a smooth surface, and i got to be able to just kind of relax and do my thing. You know. I don't okay. think I took my meds today. You better have. <laughs> of course I did. I'm just being silly willy. <laughs> Tickle and <drain>. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. I'm trying to do the closer. Get ready for your part. Okay, guys. It looks like we're calling it a day. Um, didn't do much today, even though we were here all day. I know you worked in the garage, right? Yep. Did you film any of it? Yeah, you showed me my workbench. That's right. Yes, dear. My beautiful your workbench. Workbench. My beautiful workbench. <laughs> Getting some loving over there, Kirsty. Yeah. Looks like it. <laughs> Don't open your mouth. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we are, Kirsty and I are heading over to the ranch to give the horsies their supplements. Yes. And we're going to take Gabby out and work Gabby. I might, but I don't know. I need to make sure he's still not feverish from his shots yesterday. Okay. Um, and yeah, so that's you tonight. Today you're gonna see part of yesterday and today. Something like that. Yeah. So. Oh, you know what? Do we have enough time? Um, so Kirsty can kind of explain what was going on with Paloma. Remember, we, we kept that? telling everybody we were going to go into detail, and we still haven't done that. Oh, okay. So, technically, he had to go into the vet to have an, um, well, they took at least two to three of his melanomas from the doctor of his tail to basically convert it into an autoimmune vaccine to prevent the spreading or worsening of his melanomas because he is a gray. He's a little quarter pony, but he is, is typical with grays. They get melanomas, so it's a it's a typical thing, and most of the time they're malignant. Sometimes they're not, but his are. So I'm just trying to do something to help him along. Okay. So that's the whole reasoning of the surgery and so on and so forth. But he is doing very well. Yes. So anyway, we're gonna go ahead and call it an evening. 
If you liked a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today, please give us a favorite. Please give us a thumbs up. Please leave us a comment down below. We love to hear from each and every one of you. And I am a little behind again on responding, but I will get to each and every comment. Please share our video with your family and friends. But most of all, what?